this patio cooler from Amazon. Now I'm gonna use, well, we're gonna see what it looks like first, but I'm going to use this um, for my roadside bakery um, at the end of our driveway for the extra stuff that I have that I cook with YouTube. And sorry, there's a motorcycle going down the road nonstop, so I cannot get a quiet video tonight. So I'll try to edit that out, but just life around here sometimes. So anyway, I ordered this from Amazon, um, $159. So I am going to show you what it looks like when it comes in the box. And I ordered the mint, mint um, color. So this is unboxing this cooler. So very well protected. Okay, so I did the mint color. So this must be the shelf. Set that off to the side. And it is very well wrapped in here. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get it out without turning the box on its side. So very well wrapped. So this is actually good too for graduation parties and, um, and the box weighs about 50 pounds if that's what you're wondering why I'm flipping it over like this. Ours came FedEx. Okay. Okay, where's my knife? Yeah, and we have this dog in the neighborhood that just barks nonstop too. So we're really doing good tonight. I feel sorry for it because they never let it out. And our dogs are so incredibly well taken care of that it just bothers the Jesus out of me. They need to make laws for people that don't take care of their animals. Lots of styrofoam. Okay. So, and I got a dog that wants a ball. Okay. I'm going to take the lid off just so I don't break that. impressed with the size. I think I can fit quite a bit in there. I'm assuming that if you use this for graduation or wedding, you could probably get, oh my gosh, 100, 100 cans of pop in here probably. Okay, and then inside here, are probably all the pieces. And if you know me well enough, you know I don't put anything together well. Oh yeah, so we got lots more styrofoam. Make sure we get all that picked up so dogs don't get it. Okay, so I'm looking at the legs. The legs actually look pretty, pretty sturdy, like that. Just four legs. thing for caps. I'm not going to be using that. So we've got two handles and four nice size caster wheels. Okay. And lots of lots and lots of pieces, which I should be able to put that together myself. Oh, get off of there, Sammy. Okay, that's the shelf. Alright, so 
that is unboxing this. I'm going to get it put together and then um, I'll show you what the finished product looks like. I think I have to go grab some tools. So far, I'm pretty impressed with the with it. Okay, it took me 28 minutes all by myself to put this together. Actually, it was engineered really well and super easy to put together. And so I'm gonna give you a little tour of what the ice box looks like. So if you, I love this color, it comes in many colors, but it rolls really nice. And then the back side, it rolls super easy. Now it has a spot where you can um, put the thing to take the tops off of pop or beer bottles. I am not using that because I am using this for a bakery box. It, for my bake stand at the end of the driveway. So I actually really like it. And then I'm going to show you the inside. I'm going to take the camera off of this. Oops, you don't want to see me. Okay, so on the inside, it's got the nice drawers. Very nice like that. Nice handles. And it's got a nice little shelf. So I'm super impressed with it. I think this is a good price or for the quality that you're getting off of this. Super easy to put together. Like I said, it took me about 20 minutes. I did it all by myself. The tools were all included. The only thing I did not put in was the um, this thing for if you wanted to have a spot for to put the top things on, but. Anyway, not probably not important, but anyway, highly recommended.